Okay, so people ask all the time, what's the best way to check for chlorine on their swimming pool? And this is the absolute best. We're gonna use DPD powder, and let me show you how easy it is. You take this powder and get one scoop and put it in the large test tube, and that's filled to the number 10. If it turns red, you've got chlorine. Now here's the cool part. We're gonna find out how much. Each drop that Jake is about to put in is worth one half of one point. So there's one drop, so that's a half. And what we're looking for is this to turn clear. There's two drops, so we're at one. Three drops, one and a half. We're getting close. Four drops. And now see the sample is turned clear. So we know that the chlorine on this pool, four drops, each drop is a half a point, so that is two. All right, so what we also love about the DE, DPD powder is that if you if your chlorine is zero, you're gonna see it instantly. So he's got the water test kit and he's gonna put in the powder, one scoop of the DPD powder, and it should turn red. Drop that in, swirl it. Now see this sample, how it did not turn red. Hold it up, Jake, where we can see it. Yeah, see that sample is still clear. That tells us that the chlorine is zero. So we know we gotta add some chlorine, but DPD will test it very accurately. Um, all the way down to point 0.2. We're using the lower scale. Hold it this way to the side. So on this test tube right here, you can see there's a line here for the 10. There's a line here for the 25. So when we test on this level, each drop is a half. When we test on this level, each drop is point 0.2. So if we have a, a sample that we think is going to have low chlorine, we'll fill it to this one, and then we can go point 0.2, point 0.4, point 0.6 and get a very accurate reading. So if you're looking for a good way to test chlorine, the DPD powder on the Taylor test kit is the way to go. We'll put a link in the description. Thanks for watching and have a great summer.